Hi, John. If you're going to be home tonight, 10 o'clock, Channel 5 News, I'll be on TV. I'll find out about the agent stuff I told you about later. Bye. Hello. John, it's Bill. Hi. Hi. Listen, uh, you want the guy's number? Oh, yes. Uh... You know, he. Uh, I guess he'll probably be expecting you to call. You could use the name John Moser if you want. Why is that? Why should I use that name? I mean, uh, somebody might have referred to you as that. Oh, okay. Uh, his name is Richard Cataldi. Yeah. Uh, numbers 245 And what does he do again? You don't know? He's an agent. No, why should I use my real name? Um, does he know me my, by my real name? I might, uh, thing is, uh, Joel might have referred to you by uh, your your name, John. Is your name John? Oh, okay. It doesn't matter. You know, you could be, just me. You could mention either names. Like, uh, I'll, pro- I, I'll probably tell him. Mention both names. Yeah. I guess you could say uh, Bill Landis and uh, Joel Reed said you should call. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Okay. Okay, great. Let me know what happens. I'll give you a call in an hour or so. All right. Within the hour, I'm still I'm still at work here. Yeah. I get the check tomorrow, and then I can start thinking, oh. you know. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Great. Also, uh, the thing was in the L.A. Times yesterday. It's beautiful. Uh, I was awed by it. The next day, I looked at it, and guess what's wrong there is the box number. They put 709 instead of 799. I told the post office about it today. Oh, shit. Yeah, the post office, uh, they said they'd handle it. Yeah, I think they would. I just wanted to know if I was getting, like, thousands of letters, if I'd be there every day to pick them up. And I said, of course, of course. (laughs) Wow. So what happened on the TV thing? Were you preempted by... uh Howard Belushi. John Belushi's Actually, death. Actually, the thing that took away his, uh, this is ironic, the thing that took away his crew is that uh, it was declared unconstitutional to test for firemen in New York because it discriminates against females. That's what yeah. took his crew away. It was a big story on Friday. Yeah. You know, my heart bleeds for a woman who can't become firemen, but what can I say? <laughs> yeah. Um... I guess I should have gotten a copy of that L.A. Times. I don't know if I still can. Uh, yeah, I have a lot of it. I'll give you a copy. Okay, good. Now you know a famous person. Yeah. Oh, what were you going to be on for on TV? Channel 5. No, what were you going to be on there for? Sleazoid. Really? Yeah. Uh, was it related to the L.A. Times article? No, not at all. Um, I mean, it's just, uh, it's just that lately the publicity's been coming in. Wow. What, did they give you a five-minute interview or something? Something like that. I'll see. It'll have, the guy's very dead set on doing it, so that's good. Show me it later. All right, I'll let you go, John. Okay. Bye. Bye. Cataldi Agency. Hi. Uh, is this Richard? Yes, it is. Yeah, this is Alan Adrian, also known as uh, John Moser. Um, I was referred to you by Bill Landis and Joel Reed. They suggested I call you. Right now, do you, do you have photos and resumes? Sure, yes. Okay, uh, and you live in the city? Yeah. Right, how about uh, we meet on Thursday? That's good. Thursday at 1 o'clock? That's good. Okay. What is your address? I'm um, at 250 West 57. You say you're also known as what? Well, I, I don't know which name Bill or Joel gave you. My real name is, is John, but my stage name is Alan Adrian, so that's really the name that's important. Okay, okay so 250 West 57th Street. Yeah, Street 15127. 35127? No, 1527. 1527. What is that? That's the apartment number? No, that's the suite. Uh, the suite, yeah. Okay, good. Okay. All right, I'll see you on Thursday at okay. 1. Great. Bye.